at rate of speed. Oh, Charlie, we just saw Earth rise, and it's got to be magnificent. Charlie, it might sound corny, but the view is really out of this world. Okay, David, you ought to start getting your hands closed. Say again? Better start getting your hands closed if you're not already doing it. I was disappointed. I wanted to go with them so bad I could taste it. As far as I was concerned, that was what it was all about. Not only going to the moon, but going down the surface and walking. We're now less than two minutes away from the separation burn, which will be performed by the command module. When next we hear from them, uh, the lunar module should be undocked from the command and service module. You'll never know how big this thing gets when there ain't nobody in here but one guy. Yeah, don't get lost from out there, John. I wish I could go down there with him. You may not talk about it very much, but part of your training is coming back by yourself. wish the damn thing could hold three people. ago, Flight Director Gene Kranz requested that uh, everyone sit down, get prepared for events that are coming, and he closed with good luck to all of you. Get going, we is down among them, Charlie. Roger, I hear you weaving your way up the freeway. You're going right down US 1, Mike. Right, copy, looks great. Okay, all flight controllers, going to go for landing. Retro. Go. Econ. Go. Surgeon. Go. Fido. Go. Guides. Go. Patrol. Go. Telcom. Go. GNC. Go. Capcom, we're go for landing. Eagle, Houston, and you're a go for landing. Over. Okay, Houston, we'll give you a countdown. Four, three, two, one, fire. There, there it is. is. Oh, baby. Fish, you're coming down to that ground. Look at that reel. That's got to be, that's got to be probably Diamondback right there. When it pitches over and you get your first look, you know, there was nothing but nine million craters after a terrible sinking feeling. I obviously didn't recognize a thing after studying all these photographs, nothing looked right. How you doing, Control? We look good, you're fine. All right, how about you, Telcom? Go. Guidance, you happy? Go. Fido. Go. Roger, you're a go. You go to continued power descent. You're a go to continued power descent. Roger. 
all during this power descent. I, I kept telling myself, Jim, this is not for real. You're back in the simulator. Just remember that. Eagle Houston, it's descent two fuel to monitor over. Eagle Houston, everything's looking good here, over. Now, Houston, I'm getting a little fluctuation in the AC uh, voltage now. Roger. Stand by. Looking good to us. You're still looking good. Houston, you're looking at our Delta H. Uh, that's affirmative. Looking good to us, over. Eagle Houston, we'll monitor that's your Delta A. Beautiful. Six plus two five, throttle down. Six plus two five, five, throttle down. Roger, copy. Six plus two five. Let me try auto again now, see what happens. We got data dropout. Roger, stand by. We're going that alarm. It's, if it doesn't reoccur, we'll be go. We're going at alarm. Roger, understand. Go for landing. Roger, we got good data. Altitude, velocity, light. Eagle, we got you now. It's looking good. Over. Four forward, drifting to the right a little. Coming down to 23. 21 down. 33 degrees. We're go. Same type. We're go. Picking up some dust. And a couple of big boulders. Coming right, got a good spot. Not too bad. There comes the shadow. Oh, are we coming in? Stand by for touchdown. Stand by. Man. Houston, uh, Tranquility Base here. The Eagle has landed. Uh, there's a chair in this room. What we're witnessing now is man's uh, very first trip in a space uh, with a station stop along the route. We got a stay, Houston. Eagle, you are safe for T1. This thing came to a stop on the moon. There was kind of a letdown saying, you know, we're going to have to get it going fast again to get back home. Neil, this is Houston. What's your status on hatch opening? Okay, Houston, I'm on the porch. Neil, this is Houston, loud and clear. Radio check and verify TV circuit breaker in. Roger, TV circuit breakers in. Houston, Roger, we copy and we're standing by for your TV. I'm gonna pull it now. Houston, the Mesa came down, all right. And we're getting a picture on the TV. Got a good picture, huh? Hey, Neil, we can see you coming down the ladder now. With the surface appearance to be very, very fine-grained as you get close to it. I'm uh, at the foot of the ladder. Yeah, I'm gonna step off the limb now. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. I had a bet with somebody who didn't uh, really felt that Neil spent a great deal of time before he went figuring out his famous words and they were not extemporaneous on the spot historical words he actually felt that these words might have even been written for neil by somebody else and uh, i said well i'll bet you 500 bucks that when i get to the bottom of the ladder and nobody ever remembers what the second person to do something does anyhow i'm going to say it may have been a small step for neil but it's a big step for a little fellow like me ready for me to come out Okay. Now I want to uh, back up and partially close that. Making sure not to lock it on my way out. 
So this person said, ah, no way you're going to do that. I'm going to tell you what to say. Okay, that's a bet.